What is going on guys, it's your boy Jockey here and today uh, we are actually back on Grand Theft Auto Online because my computer decided it wanted to die. Um, so while it's at the manufacturer for the next at least couple days, um, I'm going to be on PlayStation 4. Uh, so I've been wandering around trying to find something to do and the new DLC came out I think on the 12th maybe of December and I haven't really had a chance to play it because like I said I've been on computer and uh, so I've been playing around and I actually bought this Avenger here right there uh, and whenever I first bought it I was like I don't really understand uh, how you can customize it because you have the customizations on the inside however actually let me jump in the back no there we go um, you have the customizations in the back, um, but old TAC Tactical over here that I actually forgot to introduce, um, he, let me see, I'll put you in here too, um, he asked me if you could customize, uh, the outside, or more expressly, it was the green rotor blades at night. I was like, I'm not sure, um, it didn't really give me the option, so I tried to pull it in my hanger and nothing happened it was like oh you can't bring it in your hangar I was like well that kinda sucks because you can't really change anything on the outside didn't even think about bringing it in this facility um, so you have the weapon customization here um, as well as the vehicle customization back here and it's mostly your weaponized vehicles that you can bring in not mostly it's only then you also have your I don't think it'll let me access them yeah um, you have your gun turrets. I have one in the front, one on top, and one in the back. Um, and you can cycle through them in each location. Like you don't have to swap places. You have a wardrobe, and you also have your armory. And for the purposes of this, this video, um, I'm going to change the camo so we can see it because it's still snowing outside. Um, but yeah, the cool thing is you can upgrade the armor you can add bombs. I could have swore I bought all of these. Um, actually, I want to swap. We'll leave it on cluster. Um, you can upgrade the engine, the handling, just like any of the other planes in the latest updates. You can change the livery. Um, I like this one because it was snowing outside, so I wanted it to be camouflaged. But for the purpose of this video, we're actually going to change the color to something that we could see outside. Actually, we're going to change all of it. Make it lime green. And red. That's cool. And I keep putting the crew emblem on. Um, I don't know why it takes it off. Um, and then you have where you can add your front, top, and rear turrets. So let's get this thing out of the facility. While you are the pilot, the only weapon that you have control of is your bombs. You have to have a second person to operate the turrets. Um, and you can have, as you saw, there were three seats for turrets um, because there are three different turrets. So I don't know why this music is playing. Um, and these are the green rotors that I was talking about. You cannot, for some reason, change those. Um, it doesn't really bother me because I really only see them at night. Um, but yeah, this thing, this thing's a freaking beast. It's fast. Uh, it gets you to and from the city relatively quickly, and you can come in, pick up your friends, and get out in a hurry. Um, so buying this it starts out at about 3.4 million dollars uh, I'm not quite sure the exact amount and then you can add in the vehicle customization the weapon customization and then the turret when you buy it originally there is yeah thank you uh, there is no actual 
turrets on there that is an option that you have to purchase if you want one and the option that it allows you to purchase from the website is just the front turret you actually have to customize it in your facility um, not quite sure what else to say about this thing other than it is an absolute beast uh, especially mostly if you have more than one person because if it's just you it's just nothing more than a glorified bomber that can hover but if you have more than one person at least one more person then this thing is pretty badass because you're able to have somebody on a turret shooting things on the ground that you might not necessarily be able to hit with your bombs so I believe that is all I have for today's video uh, if you like what you saw please like and subscribe um, if you didn't please subscribe anyway I think we're up to almost 30 I don't think we're quite there I think we're sitting on 28 subscribers um, and yeah we need more subscribers I'm trying to hit a hundred um, so if you guys could help me out that'd be great um, as always I'm Jockey and you guys have a great day